So I want to share with you my journey with Faster Way, how it started, why it started, and what it's been like. So I've been in health and fitness for over 10 years. I thought I knew all the things, but I will be very honest in telling you that I could do the workouts, got the workouts down. You tell me to have a supplement, I can do a supplement. But when it came to my knowledge in the kitchen, I didn't really have it. I didn't have the education that I really felt like I needed to succeed. So I just kind of did what they said to do, right? Just kind of whatever the trend was, you know, eat every two hours, cut carbs, eat high fat, all the things. Done the keto and the um, Whole30 and I mean, all kinds of things, y'all. And when it came to last spring, I was getting close to my 45th birthday. So April of 2020, I was in a real bad place. Now, granted, we were in the middle of COVID and a lot of us were in a really bad place, but I was having a cocktail every night, which I don't normally do. And I was kind of just eating all the things and the fluff was growing. The bloat was growing. My energy was decreasing. And I was kind of at a, at a loss. Like, what in the world do I do? Like, how do I turn this around? One of my very best friends asked me in April, Christy, join this with me. I, I want you to do Faster Way to Fat Loss with me. And I'd never heard of the program before. And I was like, I don't want to. I, I you know, I'm just going to sit over here and live in my blawful bliss, right? Which, I mean, we all know that it really wasn't bliss. And she just kept please do it. Like if you do it, I know you'll hold me accountable and I really want you to do it with me. So I looked into it and I thought, well, I mean, we're in quarantine, can't go anywhere. Might as well give it a shot. And so I jumped in. Now, initially I thought, oh my gosh, how am I going to learn all these things? Because the program involves intermittent fasting and carb cycling and they wanted me to give up gluten and dairy. What? Like, I'll be very honest with you, I never thought I needed to give up gluten and dairy, but it was part of the program, it was a recommendation for the first six weeks, and I thought, okay, if I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna go all in. So I jumped in with both feet, 100% committed. My first six weeks, I learned so much, I was blown away. The knowledge that was shared and taught about nutrition, the science behind why it's good to intermittent fast and how to do it correctly, why it's good to carb cycle and how it trains your body to move from fat to carbs back and forth to efficiently burn the fat in your body and increase your energy. I mean, y'all, it was so eye-opening. And oh, by the way, when I gave up <laughs> gluten and dairy, my body was like, whoa, like it was a party. It had a party. It literally let go of so much bloat and inflammation. I didn't even know I had. So needless to say, the first six weeks blew my mind. Now the workouts were awesome and very, very challenging and different every single day, which was something else that I found awesome. Like I was so excited about it because I'd been in other things and other programs where, you know, every Monday was the same workout. You follow a program, you're following a program, same Monday, every same Monday, every workout, and then so on and so forth. And you know, after a while, you kind of know what's coming, right? Well, not with these workouts. So I was encouraged by that. What I was mostly encouraged by is in the first six weeks, I personally lost 14 pounds and 11 inches. And I was like, what in the world? I've never experienced anything like that before. And I just had a fire lit. Like I was so excited about the knowledge I'd gained about counting macros and what macros actually are. And I used to think it was a foreign language. And then I was like, oh, okay, I get it. But y'all, I had never felt as good from the inside out as I began to feel after I initiated this lifestyle. And it changed me. It changed my mindset. It changed just my knowledge. I feel so empowered, so free when it comes to nutrition. And I'm not a great cook. What I mean by that is I can't walk in the kitchen and go, okay, we're just going to throw everything together. A little of this, a little of that. It's going to be great. No, 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 no. That's not Christy. 
but I've learned so much that I actually can do that sometimes. Like, oh, this spice might be good in here, or, you know, I'm gonna throw this vegetable in here too. Like, I'm learning and I'm growing. Why do I tell you all of this? Because it's so easy, and I was in this mindset, you know, getting into my mid-40s, well, maybe this is just the best it's gonna be. I'm just gonna be bloated, a little bit less energy than I should have, that I wanna have, but you know, I'm in my mid-40s, so I guess that's par for the course. And I'm here to tell you, that was what, I was proved so wrong on that mindset. Y'all, I'm 45 years old, I feel 25. I'm not even kidding, other than the little crick in my knee sometimes. <laughs> And I just have gained so much knowledge that now I cannot help but want to share it to, to others, with others, teach other people the same freedom by learning and understanding and applying it to their own lives. I was woken up in a whole different way. And I've come to love intermittent fasting. And oh, by the way, I love to eat. And I'm not deprived. It was like, oh wait, I get to eat more than 1200 calories? Awesome! And blew me away, right? Because I was thoroughly expecting to have to eat less and work out more. And that's not how this program worked. It changed everything. And after several months of doing it, I was like, I need, I feel obligated to become certified in this program to teach other people to use encouragement, love, support, accountability, and knowledge to share the love. I couldn't just keep this to myself because I needed others to understand the true power of being educated and feeling empowered and free from the scale, from food, from just the, the heaviness that nutrition can sometimes bring and to be shocked by what your body is able to do for you when you commit, when you learn, when you grow, and when you actually just focus on taking one step at a time, one foot in front of the other, and you start to make progress. And y'all, it's amazing. It's absolutely amazing. It's a life-changing experience. And I know that can sound cliche, and we can hear that all over social media, like, oh, you've got to do this, you know, drink this drink or take this pill or, you know, whatever. And this is going to change your life. But the thing that's the, the most beautiful part about this program is it's, there is nothing required as far as there's no pills. There's no supplements. You just learn good whole food nutrition and how to fuel your body correctly. And that's what I learned. And <laughs> holy smokes, it was mind blowing. So this is my story. This is why I'm here sharing this with you. Because if you're in a place of feeling discouraged, feeling like you've tried all the things, feeling like you have no idea what else to do, you don't have the knowledge you wish you had around nutrition, you're not really sure how you should be working out. And when people use uh, terms like intermittent fasting and carb cycling and counting macros, your head spins right off your body, right? I'm here to tell you to just breathe. I can teach you and I can show you all the things and we do it step by step by step. And I'm with you every step of the way, linking arms with you, holding you accountable, loving you, encouraging you, supporting you and reminding you to just give yourself grace, to trust the process and learn everything one step at a time. And as you slowly start to apply, you will be so blown away. Listening to my clients and their wins gives me so much joy because it's from the inside out. They are so excited about the changes that they're experiencing, that they're feeling. And it is so exciting and rewarding to watch it take place. Don't stay in a place of discouragement. Don't let excuses 
lie to you. Don't think you're not worth it, that you can't do it, and that it's just supposed to be this way. You're just supposed to be kind of halfway there and stay in a place less than where you'd want to be. I want you to ask yourself a question. Where would I love to be in six months? And then girl, let's get you there because it's so possible and it's so worth it. You're worth it. I hope this encourages you. To learn more, click on the link below this video and let's chat. I'm here for you, ready to be your biggest encourager.